Alright, so, um, I'm editing. Obviously, and I'm just gonna make this quick. I'm tired. I'm really tired. I'm not gonna lie. It's, I got a lot. I don't even, five, five no point. The video. Alright, listen, I know this video is long. This is a disclaimer at the beginning of it. If you don't want to watch it, that's fine. But there's a lot of good information in here. I'm going to put timestamps, so you're going to at least be able to go through a lot of it. But, like, rewatching this, I've rewatched this a million times. I've cut this down from an hour and a half to two-hour fucking video. It was two videos that I'm smashing into one because it's it's just good luck with jewelry and me honing. So I figure, why not? But there's a lot of conversational investment aspects in this. I also profit on my investment in this. You're going to see that because it's a week later. And I was right. Everything I said, the margin I even predicted was accurate. That's what's crazy. Um, but whatever. I do that too often, right? Please just like, comment, and fucking subscribe. Like, I deserve it because of how many accurate predictions I've made in the market since the beginning of the game, and you can watch all of my market videos, right? Like, um, then you have people that literally devote whole, like, series on their channels to to the economy, and they're, like, wrong all the time. Like, I don't know how you guys keep following these idiots, but whatever. And then they'll, they'll say basic shit, too, like, supply and demand. Like, shut the fuck up. I love people, but, like, come on. Anyways, let's get right into the video. Uh, please enjoy it. I'm sorry that it's long, but there is so much good information in here. Like, there's so many things about my mentality, about the way that I play the game, the way that I look at things. There's a couple massive Easter eggs in here that I'm going to flag, basically, with something and the timestamps, and you're just going to have to go and look for it. Like, I'm going to try to make this as easy as I can on you guys, but if you really want to get the best knowledge out of this, there's a lot of dead time because I'm kind of just talking to myself and hanging out, but if you really want to get the most out of this, you're going to watch the whole thing. I'm not putting the outro. I'm not putting a special intro for this. I took both of those off. I made a whole fucking intro of that, just like the other one, a really cool one, and I'm not even going to put it in here because I just... It, this is ridiculous. It's really long. I, I didn't even do a ton of edits. Like, at first, I had a bunch of funny little edits, like the Kappa thing and stuff again, and these nuts, but I took it all out because I was like, I... I want you guys to get the knowledge out of this, but but I'm afraid that it's going to be too long, and that sucks because it just kind of shows that you're a TikTok generation, that you don't have the ability to take a second to focus on something and really try to learn something, and maybe it means I just suck as a teacher, but I don't think so because I tell this stuff to people all the time, and they get it, and maybe you just need another explanation. Come sit with me in Discord. Come talk about it. Like, comment, subscribe. Comment in the comment sections. I can reply to you for hours, especially when I'm at work. Let's make this a thing. I don't, like, this is what I do. This is what I do. That's what that last video is supposed to be telling you guys. It's like, I have 10 years of teaching people how to be better at fucking everything anything give me a fucking problem i'll find a solution to it and i'll make it more efficient that's just like all i'm good at i don't know how else to say it like let's just get into this right like, that's the point so i just had a really good uh kind go run so we got it sold instantly like i literally just listed this i'm not even kidding i just got it and i just listed it and it was a good piece maybe i should have kept it because, like, let's be real, that's, like, a premium. That's a keeper. Like, I could have put that in any of my crit spec classes and reworked their build somehow to make that work. You know what I mean? That's a pretty solid piece, but it's also just a better piece sold in some ways, too, I guess. I don't know. But either way, I'm happy. I definitely undersold it because when I listed it, there was two other pieces there for the same price, but this one sold instant. And I put an 80k bid, and the person bought it at 120, so I probably could have put it up for, like, 150. I definitely undersold this. So... Yeah, but it's okay, because it gave me 120k gold, so now I'm going to do this video. I also got the Pally's 4P set, so... Um, I'll just do, like, I guess a quick check-in video type of thing. Um, while I also go try to get a character 1580. Um, he's also got two free taps. Um, if you join the Discord, you can see a lot of it. Like, I kind of share a lot of it in Discord, but... The... Yeah, I get... Um, let's see... What do I want to do? Yeah, I'll make it quick. We're just going to swap. I already got her up to 65, but she went through like 600 stones to get that, so that was kind of rough. Um, But we're getting there. We're getting there. I think because I got that jewelry piece and I keep getting pieces like that, that I'm actually on like way ahead of track. I'm, I'm definitely, I think, going to hit my goals, but... I mean, yeah, I can't. <laughs> like, I'm try I trying not to share everything, but the reason I have the Discord is so I can keep, like, a track record of it, too. So I feel bad because people in there are just seeing me get really, really lucky. Um, but I can't do anything about I really can't do anything about it. You know what I mean? Um, we're at that point. 
we're at that point because I've gone. I keep. I've been making the bounds, and I might have some. Yeah, I do actually have a couple. It's too bad I can't collect them from there. Um, but it's only gonna be forty, right? So it's very slow when you're doing it the way I'm doing it. Um, I could go use energy and farm it, but I'm not. I'm just gonna buy them. You don't sell a piece of jewelry for 120k and then not spend some of it. Like I'm feeling pretty good. And obviously, I'm on. I'm not gonna do that video anymore that I talked about where that kid wanted me to push a character from sixty to ninety. Um, just no, no, because they're giving us that update where it's gonna be silver. So now these alts are really paying for themselves, especially the ones that have bound stones because I've been playing them. Like, like get out of here, <laughs> get out of here, dude. So the, yo, I, that's the crazy value, crazy value that they're gonna start returning to. Um, but yeah, so it does suck that I can't do that for that kid now, but or I could, but it would be stupid. Like I'm gonna go put the not anywhere from twenty to hundred k gold into a character. Nah, nah, we can wait. We can wait happily. All right, I don't think I can do more. Because I use the skip tickets, but you can only use 40 a day. Sure, we got just a week. She's gonna have to play the cycle, but I'm actually on a play time right now, so I'm gonna be playing this whole time. Uh, let's go back and we'll go home. But yeah, I'm fucking pumped. I'm pumped because I don't get to just like, I'm like all of you. I'm not, I don't get to sit here and just spend gold and have fun like the whole time honing. Do you know what I mean? It's not a thing. As a matter of fact, because my silver being where it is, I wouldn't even, I'm not even gonna be able to do this that long, anyways. Um, I was hitting a piece. I think it was this piece. So I don't have any materials. I do have like 13 cube tickets. So I should really go do those. Uh-oh. -uh. <laughs> it's actually it's like there's a lot of people playing right now too. Uh, let's see. Here's what we'll do. We will... We're going to buy... We had 40 of them, right? So 100... Uh, we're going to buy 140 of these. Hopefully it's not too expensive. These books don't cover this range, do they? No, they don't. Where the fuck? Here we go. So we're gonna buy 140 of them. Whatever. Not a big deal. Oh, uh, you know what I should do with the 120k, though? I should go pimp out some characters. I get some better jewelry pieces for cheap. But we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna take that, and we're gonna home away. And we're gonna hope we get lucky. Um, this one might pity. If it goes up to 50%, we're gonna obviously stop tapping. Um, yeah, I think we're going to start having Because I use materials up to that point anyways, too. So, like, 40, whatever. I'm still going to count this as, like, a 25% or a 30% or artisan because I used a lot of materials on it. And now we're going to go tap the uh, rest and see if we get lucky. Obviously, we're fishing for that one tap. Didn't get the one tap. Now we'll go back through and see if we can get lucky on the second round. And sometimes you'll never get lucky. It's totally okay. Play with the helmet for a little bit but you know when you have this much gold and you actually kind of do this like you realize that the and you see like the pity going up like two three percent each chance right you realize that it's not really that bad just to pity it anyways i know that the true cost is like a lot Ooh, i'm doing pretty bad though <laughs> oh my god i'm not satisfied with that i actually really want to just buy more and tap them all we'll do Maybe 240. Yeah, that's fair. 240. And then I'm going to go see what else I can do with the gold. Um, but ordinarily, like, I wouldn't do this. I would go get the cubes. Um, but I kind of want to. I just want to see if I get any low hits. Like, I could start hitting the 18s too, which is what I really should do. But. buying stones on her <sighs> yay okay so i don't know what that was but i mean i can obviously rewind the clip and find out um yeah 700k whatever we'll do it so let's continue tapping these two oh, 15 this one might go all the way yeah one of these is gonna end up going all the way i already know it because everything else kind of one tap like the weapon like two tapped or some shit um and that's usually how I can kind of gauge this. And then this piece is going to pity in this range too, so. 
I'm expecting one of these two. I'm just gonna try and get it to the pity wall, I guess. Yeah, 30%'s not bad. Okay. <clears throat> so, 9 out of 10 times these characters are gonna pity. Uh, in a couple of these regions. How do I want to play this? I really, because I really want to put this 80k, um, not towards the, like, secondary characters in the regard that you think, but, like, there's a lot of books that are cheap right now, and I guess I can just go take a look at the books real quick and see if there's any I want to buy. And this is why people think I'm nuts, because <laughs> I do shit like this, and then they have characters that don't have, like, all of their stats appropriate, but, um, like, this is a steal. Oh, but I already have it. And I'm sure I have a lot of these. Uh, Shadow Hunter. I mean, all of these are a steal. Let's just be real. Reaper Lunar being that cheap, kind of a steal, too. The Gunslinger books being cheap. I mean, all of this is, like, glorious. So it's really just a Delone Knight book being that cheap. Like, come on. Um, that's a hit. I spent like 5k each of these. 5, 6,000 each. Um, but yeah, just look at the price of these. Where's Igniter at? That's the question. Okay, so we're getting back up to books that are, like, more reasonably priced. Um, Deathblow being that looks crazy, though. But, like, yeah, like, I could close out on Cursed All or something right now. And maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't, but I just feel like I could. Like, any book, essentially, that I pick right now, I can just be done with it. So I am semi-conflicted. Semi-conflicted. Maybe I should just go for the eye level, get the books later, because they'll go down in price. I don't know. But it's not even just that. It's not just the books. It's like some of these characters only need, like, a few taps. I could buy the materials. Do you know what I mean? Like, they're cheap. I don't know. I don't know. I'm conflicted. I'm conflicted. Actually, I guess I should wait for the update, because then we can just send jewelry pieces to all the characters with no fee on cost. I could use it to pay for a bunch of Walton buses. Yeah, why don't we do that? Start getting them their betrayal set so I can clear Chaos and Dins quicker. Nah, fuck it, we're going home. <laughs> we're going to home. Got another 240. This is not how you should do this, but I don't care. Whatever. Uh, I'm gonna leave this. I'm not gonna tap the weapon quite yet. That's probably gonna be the last thing I tap. Okay, I'm convinced this isn't gonna hit as well, so we're gonna pull it to 30, and then we're gonna start tapping one of these. Also, we're dealing with the Honor Shard, or, or this is the first character, like, out of all of, like, I got three characters to 80, didn't have this problem. The Paladin, I did buy um, Marvelous on because I had to, um, but I actually am convinced that she's going to hit a wall with, with fucking Marvelous, <laughs> um, which is crazy, because none of the other characters really did. Oh, I can't tap that one. I guess I could start going with the weapon, but I really don't want to. Watch, that'll be the one that went taps, though, so... This is a quick way to see how 80 to 120k just goes. Gone. Oh. You know what? That's not a bad idea. But that's a risky idea. <sighs> oh. I gotta think on something. But I'll just edit this out if it doesn't look good. Actually, you guys have no idea. 
You know, that's not a bad idea, man. It's not a bad idea. Because that's getting removed, and that's getting removed, and that's getting removed, right? So. How do I go about this? What do I have? Like, really, I should buy all the greens of these, right? Isn't that kind of what they told us? It's too many, though. It's just too many. It'd be too many fucking books to get. I think in that regard, we're going to wait for the update, because I'm not... Uh, maybe not. Like, Igniter, I should probably get up. Yeah, like, wait a minute, let me take a look. This is what I'm saying, like, there's an update around the corner that everybody should kind of be planning around. Like, what's the most expensive? Oof. There's only two of them in the market. Oh, I'm conflicted. Oh, I'm conflicted, I'm conflicted, I'm conflicted. So, like, should I go through and just start opening books? That's kind of why I'm so conflicted right now. Are they going to turn all of these into something, or are they just going to take them out of our inventories? I am kind of opening those preemptively on here, but chances are we'll need them. Not quite there, but whatever. Alright, let's continue. Actually, you know what? We're going to hit the weapon. Oh my god, see, I told you it was like two tap. I told you it was like two tap. I knew it because everything else was fucking pitying, and this is why I mean, like, you're kind of fishing. <laughs> stop. Stop. You can't do that. Like, smile, okay, stop. They're gonna think I'm hacking. <laughs> oh, I just get their game. I really do get their game. I played too many games like this. I played a lot of mobile games, and this is like essentially how all mobile games RNG works. It's not real RNG, it's probability. And they disguise it as RNG. RNG, what RNG is supposed to be, is there's supposed to be a daily number that gets sent out into the system in the server that decides basically which accounts are going to get lucky based on a number. An RNG, a random number sequence. The thing is, is this doesn't work like that. What they're showing us is it's saying that wrong. You're, that's the way it's supposed to be, and what's actually happening instead is they're having these, like these like it's like a hidden pity system it's like basically it's like we're never gonna let you pity that's why people are like i pitied like six items in a row i'm like you're full of shit like you're full of shit they wouldn't do that they know that that would make any player in the game quit if you think that the developers can allow for something like that to happen you're wrong because nobody in the world would stay playing a game if they pitied their whole selection and then watch their friend get a bunch of one taps like no 
No, those same, same people that pity a bunch also one-tap a bunch. Um, but the problem is they'll one-tap a bunch here and then pity a bunch here where it's expensive or the opposite. So it makes it feel like they're pitying a lot and once. But if you do it like a if you respect the ratio thing, like I said, and you sit here and you fish for it, then you can fish for the right probabilities and save yourself gold in the long run. Granted, you just watched me spend like 80k. Um, but you watched me spending <clears throat> 80k spreading out the love on my character. Trying to fish. Oh, but I'm gonna I'm definitely gonna run out of stones. That's the problem. Like she's not making it. Actually, I didn't realize how far away she actually was um, from the goal. Well, holy crap. Uh, we'll tap a couple more because we are gonna do I mean she still does have like the two hundred and something stones that'll come from the cubes. Um, but we're only gonna tap these to thirty percent and then we're gonna go actually I think tap a different character. Which is also what I was doing with the Zerker and the Bard. The Zerker actually hit eighty before the Bard did because he hit a one tap on the weapon and the Bard pitied the weapon. Um, yeah. But we did good. That's good. Just getting that one tap on the weapon or two tap on the weapon, whatever it was, like, that was premium. Absolutely premium. Okay, so now everything's 30%. So these are all going to pity. I think I'm just going to not tap. I'm just going to leave it where it is. Um, and come back to it once I have the stones because I'm basically what's going to happen is I'm going to go do all the cubes. All the cubes are going to give me all those honing materials. I'm going to make this pity, most likely. And if it doesn't pity, that's great, but most likely I'm going to make this pity. But I've also, this is where I stopped using materials in the first place because usually I only do it with materials until I have to. Like, I, I wasn't going to get these characters to 80 for, I think, like, a week or so. Um, but either way, we're doing it early because we got the gold. And so you're just not going to see the rest of this probably get tapped. You're, yeah, to be honest. Um, so, I should get about 200 more stones, then. Alright, let's, uh, let's see, what, see what we got. So, he has not been touched. Like, at all. So, and we're not gonna really have that many taps, let's be real. So, we're only, actually, I'm not gonna leave myself broke, either. We're only gonna do, I guess, 10 taps. Um, which, saying it out loud is actually kinda sad, but... Um... Shit, I don't know. I don't want to start with the weapon because it'll only be six taps. Um, although, it does make the most sense, but he's also got no stones either. Fuck. I'm thinking because these last three characters are going to be so fucking expensive. Or really last two because the scrapper's pretty much... Like, she's going to make it there because even if I just put all the materials from the events and everything into her, she makes it. Um, guaranteed. So, that, like I said, I know I'm going to get four. I don't know if I'm going to get five and six in the other video. I probably didn't upload that, but let's just go for it. Okay. That's kind of what we expected. Um, but as you can see, he's also got a shit ton of bound stones. Um... They've all been farming forever. See, so that was two taps. So he had like 1,900 bounds or some shit like that. Uh, this will be the last one we hit for now on the weapon. Yep, and that's pretty much all the stones. So we will now we just go elsewhere for a bit. We'll do what we usually do, one tap fish. Yeah, one tap fish. <laughs> I love how well it works. That's the crazy part. Like, please tap like I tap. Please tap like I tap. Can we call it the M method, the evolve method? Like, can we, like, coin that? Because, like, I kind of am. Like, I've been doing this since the beginning of the game. I've been telling everybody to do it this way. Nobody listens to me. <laughs> uh, we can just call it, I guess, one tap fishing, too. But I totally deserve some credit for this one. And uh, we're just going to keep doing it, really. That's the plan. Um, obviously, this character, like the Scrapper, is probably going to end up costing me eventually to do. Uh, we'll go for another 120, and then that's it. Um, I know I keep saying that, but I'm having fun. Like, this is addicting. This is the addicting part of the game is where you get, like, a, bunk, a bunch of gold, and you're just like, oh, I'm going to fuck with it. Really, what I should have done is I should have invested it. Actually, I'm just going to say what I was going to say. 
here's a gold nugget in the video like usual um chances are when they release this update with the 1490s getting there for silver that these are going to shoot up in price like uh we're still going to have these and we're still going to need them and 12 i'm not saying they're going to shoot up to 50 60 gold but they're probably going to go up to 20 or 30 that's eight gold profit margin it's a 40 50 percent gold profit margin so remember how i said a long time ago that we would never see good good margins again the reason i'm not really selling it full 100% though is because it could not. It could actually go the opposite direction and just completely crash. But I, again, that same principle as before, it, it's kind of at that equilibrium where I don't think it could go below 12, 10 or gold, 10 gold, 12, 8 gold. So I think the, the lowest point you can go to is like 8, so you're risking 4 gold, which is 30%, versus the potential of like uh, 80%, 60, 70, 80% profit, which is more likely because people, like I would, like I want to, Actually, now that I was thinking, I was thinking about it halfway through doing this, I was like, I should have taken the ADK and put it into these. Because here's the thing, there's probably not that many here. Like for eighty thousand, I'm just curious. Yeah, so for I could have got ten thousand for one hundred fifty, which means that you yourself could put the price pool from twelve to fifteen. Like right now, I could have just taken the price up to sixteen completely, sold at fifteen. Uh, you know, whittled it away. You sit on the stock and you sell a little bit at a time because it makes everybody think that they're going up, right? Because of the update and. Yeah, I, kind of, I fucked up here because I could have just taken 80K, shifted the market. This is what I was trying to tell you guys before. Take 80K. Anybody who has the gold to do this, you can do it. I could take the 80K, shift. But remember, there's a risk here. There is an inherent risk that if not enough people want the stones afterwards to make alts, that you're going to get stuck with them. So just keep that in mind. But you could get the easy gain here. You basically buy up to 15. Um, could I have? Actually, I couldn't have done that because I needed. So let's do 4,500, I think. Yeah, so more like 6,000, right? Yeah, so for six, because I, I was actually 120,000 gold, right? So let's just be real. Um, so I could buy 6,000, or you know what? We're going to actually say 7 because the 72 is what the 15 is. So yeah, you buy 7,000 of them. I could have pushed the price from 12 to there. It's 3 gold per um, thing, you know, or not really because you're buying some of them at 13 and 14 and most of them at 15, actually. So that's a lie. That's a cap. But you couldn't, yeah, you get the point. You kind of see where I'm going with this, though. And then I'll bet the bulk beyond, beyond 16, like 5,000, I bet it's not that big. I'll bet the bulk's kind of small. As a matter of fact, yeah, that's it. Actually, I'm not going to say any more on that. I'm just going to leave that where that is. Because the thing is, is, like, that is a risky investment. Like, it could go up, it could go down. That has two ways that that can sway. So the one bad thing about doing this the way I'm doing this is you can't use your free taps. That's usually what people will say to me. But the reality of it is is that you can save the free tap stones and then use them when you have a piece that's not touched yet. Like, th there's some logic that when people hit you with it, you're like, are you for real? Like, did you really just say that? Like, it fucking mattered? Because <laughs> it doesn't. Like, all of any one of these pieces that you pick, you could get up within a week. I really want to buy another 120 and tap, but no, 8K is kind of the break point. Just because we have to kind of respect the natural order of things to a degree. Like, I already didn't just respect it a lot. <laughs> and it wouldn't suit my account to continue not respecting it. So we stay at the 8K, stay where we're at. We're not going to keep breaking it. Um, I, I think he's doing pretty good considering how many stones he still has left. Um, although he did only get one, one free tap, so wasn't exactly crazy either uh <laughs> yeah i like that angle the best so uh <clears throat> let's just kind of get right into this and basically say um oops we did it again so i mean i'm just having really good luck lately so i'm just gonna flip through really fast and show like i mean it's a nice piece I probably should have kept it. Like, I'm thinking I should have kept a lot of these, to be honest with you. Um, what do I got now? Oof, that's not... It's too bad. But I am on a grudge stone. Like, I could technically make that work. Um, pieces like that. But anyways, so I got another 100,000 gold. And I know I got the other clip of me doing the same thing. <laughs> so I guess I'm just gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna blow it. Like there's no reason for me to use it on any of this stuff. Um, I do want to say that I'm gonna do something that makes my life easy, and everyone's gonna hate it. And I'm trying to hide that I do this for a long time, but um, 
I mean, this is something I actually do, though. <laughs> um, it's actually, I think it's like 12. Yeah, because you need 1100. What can I do with this? Because I have... No. It's a lot of gold. It's a lot of gold. And the value's not going to be there. I already know it. Um, we're going to do something on screen for you that I usually, like, when the new stones come out, this will be valuable. Right now, not so much. But again, it makes my life easy. I don't know if that feels. I still got 100k. I don't care, dude. I'm still loaded. All right, so now we're going to buy uh, tickets because... The, listen to me that some, when the new stones come out remember that I said this that there's actually a value to this if you play the game the way I play the game just uh, listen to me listen to me listen to me because I can help you this shit's easy for you all so right now um, 9 out of 10 times this isn't going to be a good deal um, let's see so I think we're going to get 30 total if we do it this way oh, no whoa so uh, I think 10 right. we'll get 10 five and five um and then we'll just keep that up just because i have all my stuff separated like all my items go into the system log and then um all of my party raid chat is here in normal chat and then world chat's like all the other crap to see in the fucking the sea and the land and the sky and the heavens to see so it registered here um so now that i've proofed the pudding I get 10 each because it's rested, and then I'm, that means you're going to get a total of 30, as long as I can find the other 15. Um, and what that allows me to do is not have to go do those, and believe it or not, it saves you like a minute to anywhere to five minutes every day. Um, and when the, when they're actually, alright, so this is the math I had to do. Well, let's go ahead and uh, pull that up. Hmm. Let's do it the way that we did it before, which is notepad, yeah, there we go. We can pull that up there, so we can move this over here. Okay, struggling a little. Anyways, let's get back to this. So we got 30 stones, so 30, and then I'm pretty sure the price of stones right now is like 40, um, 44, we're going to low ball at 40, um, times 40, uh, or actually we're not going to, I'm sorry, we're not going to do it that way, you're supposed to do it like this, so it's 10 per, and then just times 50 tickets, um, so 10 times 50 tickets, because that's how many total stones, would be 500 stones. And then times um, 40 gold. So 20k. So you're losing like 13k right now. But when they were up in price, when it was 500 times, I don't know, what was like the good point that we had? Like, let's just say 60. All right, we'll just go up 20 gold. Um, see what I'm saying? So then you're kind of getting your time value. I'm playing 2.5 times a week. You see where I'm going with all this? Like, you guys starting to kind of get this. Like, it's more about paying the gold to save you time to get your gold somewhere else. But because... You, you, it's like in, in RuneScape we call it lo uh, paid losses. Like you, <sighs> fuck, I don't remember. That's the problem. Um, <clears throat> sometimes I just know too much, and that's the issue. It's in some of these videos. I don't really have a, a good memory of what it was called, but it was um, it was basically like you knew you were taking a hit, but you were taking less of a hit doing this than something else, and it was faster, or you were taking more of it because it was faster. It's like it's just, I don't know how to explain it. It's freeing up time so I can do something else, and even though I'm taking a hit because I'm earning more overall resources on the account, it doesn't matter. I can take a 10k gold hit because me doing this allows me to go make more than 10k in that same period of time. I guess that's kind of what I'm saying. Um, that's a really, it's a really hard concept to explain because I don't remember the RuneScape thing, but the RuneScape thing explains it perfectly. It's basically like you buy like mithril darts compared to adamant darts or some shit. I just don't remember what the fuck it was. I can go do some research. I'll do some research. Um, I haven't played RuneScape in forever. But anyways, uh, yeah, so just with, like, 60, it would be profitable. So if those new, new stones come out, you're going to get 10 each again. So just, uh, I guess this is good stuff for the future. And this is something that's not inflated. Like, it works no matter what, pretty much. <clears throat> or we'll just say 500, because it's always going to be 500 stones. Um, let's just say they're 100 gold apiece, dude. Bang. Like, bang. Like, it's, it's 20k profit, and that's what I was doing at one point. So now that we've established that, we'll just click out of the notepad, click out of that. 
Uh, and now let's go spend the gold, because that's real, like, I just, that was really all I wanted to do. And obviously, again, we're not going to spend any gold on secondary characters, because, I mean, I might save some of this for buses. Or I could buy a jewelry piece myself, right? I actually have another 100k jewelry piece on one of these characters that's selling, too, and I don't know if it's old, but I'm not even kidding. I got three of them this week, like... Dude, the game said, bless you. <laughs> like, I'm not even kidding. I, I don't even know what the fuck happened this week. I don't know what happened. I'm not cheating, I swear. <laughs> this shit's cracked, though. Um, I guess we could tap him. But he gets so unlucky. He gets so unlucky. <clears throat> and actually, I really want to tap her. I can't do much with that do I have an empty I don't okay all of these are in the pity range too okay so some of these I'm gonna have to force anyways though because I won't have enough of those stones so why don't we just go ahead and do it and get it out of the way oh we'll do this 30 percenter that's the point in getting excess gold is that you get to do shit like this Just by, we were doing 240 last night. <laughs> I mean, we're gonna run out of stone stones pretty soon, so I mean, uh, and I, I'm not buying them. I'm not gonna buy them because I still have cubes. Like, I, I still have a lot of cubes. I haven't done any of them, let's be real. Um, I also haven't made her third piece because there's just no point. Why are you gonna waste your gold this week? Um, yeah, see. So, I should do those, but. One of these pieces is probably going to be a pity no matter what, so might as well play out the pity. Fuck it. Like, as in, like, I won't have enough of these later anyhow. Like, if I want to do this by next week, I'm going to have to do it without some of those. That's the reality. Sometimes you have to pay for time. And unfortunately, I think I'm going to be paying a pretty price on her if I want to get it by next week. She's going to be the character that hurts. Okay, so we might actually not keep fucking with her. Let's, um... Let's be smart about this. How do I want to do this? The, the reality is, is I could probably go tap a ton on him or tap a ton on her, who got a bunch of free taps anyway. I probably should just be tapping her. Um, I need to think this through. Make a good decision. I mean, I got another 100k, I guess, and I wouldn't have had it anyways. It's free. But I also just got it, so, like, I think I'm jumping the gun. Maybe I should take a second and think. Um... It's not going to it. Oh. 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 Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. <laughs> How many of these can I buy? No, I can't. But can I buy like seven? I'm not even kidding. I'm actually about to do this too. I hope these don't completely crash, but even if they do, I think I could... Is this worth it? Get everybody to 1490. All of them are farming a 1490 dungeon. I get the value back in gems. Gems are going up. Let's just say gems stay at 12k. Um, this is, like, real for me right now. I'm not kidding, actually. This could be dangerous. This could be potentially dangerous. Potentially dangerous because... I don't know what the happy medium will be for shit. Um, but yeah, like, first let's just figure out if I got 20, it'd be 20 times 4. 20 times 4. Right, because 4 a day. Times 2.5. Oh, not 8. But it should be 200. <laughs> Wait, what? 4 times 20. Level four, level four is times twenty. Because twenty characters would be eighty. Eighty level fours. Eighty level fours times two point five days, because it's two point five days a week. Two hundred. That's crazy for the record. Um, and we'll just say times four in a month. Divided by three for fives. Divided by three for sixes. Divided by three for sevens. Twenty nine seven. So it's an extra thirty k. Um, or not 30k, it's an extra, oh, yeah, let's just do it like this, 29 times 12 at a minimum. 348,000, like, are you for real? Um, maybe I should just go that route. 
I mean, right right now they're already producing like two threes though so like the value increase isn't that much like that's why i was saying that kid before was kind of right and like the more i think about it the more i process that like that does have to be applied in some senses but now that it's being given to us for silver this might be a really good investment for my account i buy six thousand of these i can get so many of the characters up um my only other problem would be a raise be a massive investment people would look at this and be like you're fucking crazy uh, I'm not going to do it. I'm going to put it into the main characters. I'm not going to do it. I'll put it into the main characters. I'll put it into the main characters. But I just wanted you guys to kind of see that. Like, that is my decision making. I maybe will buy a couple hundred, actually, though. Or maybe, like, 2,000. For 28k? Ooh. I mean, that's supposed to be steel, though. That is a good steal. Fuck it, it was a gift. And I only got 1,500 anyway, so... I'll get, like, 10k back, maybe. Not really. 6k. <laughs> All right, now, this is where we come to a crossroads, though, because, like I said, we really, I don't want to buy these. I'll buy, like, two, just to get that last tap, but, um, we're going to go tap a different character and put this gold to work and just grind it out, like, that's, you know what I mean, we still got a month left, there's no reason to play stupid with this, we're getting gifts, like, we're getting straight-up handouts from the game, we might as well take it and use it the way it's supposed to be used. Um, honestly, I really think I should just put it all into these secondary. I'm not even kidding. That's what's crazy. Like, I should buy, like, a couple thousand arrays, too. Oh, uh, I just know, because they're going to... All right, so they're... they're. Let me explain something, and this is going to be a little longer a part of the video. I don't give a fuck anymore. I, don't, I really don't care. You don't want to watch, you don't watch. Watch it in pieces. <laughs> like, this is all just going to drop. All this shit's going to drop off the fucking market. And the Great Honor, same thing. I think they're going to go up right at first because people are going to be buying them like crazy. Um, just to you can get a, everybody can get a character up. Anybody who has an alt can get an alt up at silver. Um, maybe not, though. But, uh... How much would I thought of these be? 15 grand. Fuck it. Fuck it. It's just worth it. It's worth it. It'll go so far in the account. Alright, let's see what you got, buddy. Where were we tapping? Do you have free taps? We'll leave the 18 alone. And play with the 17s. Actually, I kind of want to play with the weapon. He's going to have some new cubes, too. Yeah, alright, so... So the thing is, because I know these characters are going to pity, I am intentionally not hitting the weapon without stuff. Um, just to decrease the pity cost, because I haven't had, <clears throat> again, ratios, remember? And when I talk about ratios on your characters, and I tell you how to fish your pities, you also want to fish characters. And, like, because all those other characters got really lucky, I know that these last couple characters are going to have a hard time. It's just the natural order of the game. So you take it with a grain of salt. And for the record, if you're looking at how I own, this is why, like, my buddy, my buddy's like, that didn't get you nothing but, like, three taps. I was like, yeah, because it's because of the way I do it. I'm spreading it out. Because I'm hoping to get lucky. Truth be told, it doesn't, I don't think, actually make a difference sometimes, but, like, if you're going to pity a piece, you're probably going to pity a piece, but... Try one for the weapon. Do I have any of those? No. Damn. Okay, at this point, I don't think I'm going to be getting lucky anywhere, but uh, we can keep trying. I mean, to be fair, he didn't get a single free tap, so I'm not kidding. Like, he really didn't. He did get a one tap on whatever it was on that, um, but he did not get a single free tap. Like, oh, there we go. That was 20-ish, 20%. Take it. 
Hey, oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. We needed that. Reduce both of those. Because um, now we have free taps, so I can always tap the 18 too. We'll let this one ride out and hope for luck. Let it ride out again. Hope for luck. We're going to actually slow tap all of these ones. Uh, we're not going to buy as many. We're only going to get. 20, 120, maybe. We'll see. Like I said, I got another piece of jewelry that's selling on another character, too. I forget which one. For 120k. Or 100k. So. Uh, I'm, I'm sitting really pretty. Sometimes it just be like that. Um, oh, these ones are expensive as shit, though. Come on. Come on. I care a lot. Give it to me. Damn it. No, don't want to do that. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll get four more for the last one. This was not efficient, for the record. Like, don't... I'm not saying don't hold the way I owned, but definitely don't, um... What's it called? Don't, uh, don't buy the arrays if you can. And, yeah, we're gonna go for broke. What piece, though? That's the question. So, be honest about this. Try to predict in the comments what your piece was that you picked have any of these and except the weapon obviously because I can't get it and I will let you know which one I'm going to pick and it's probably going to be the helmet I want for that one tap it's 3% but 3% works not today <laughs> um but yeah so that's not bad I'm happy with that I know a lot of people would be like really unhappy with that but I'm I'm actually really happy with that all of these are at a decent range. They may all pity, they may all not pity. Um, if they all pity, that's gonna suck. But this update has to offer. Why the fuck is the jewelry based though? There we go. And then there's this one. So I have this listed right now too for 120k. So I got that too. So I got three I got three dynamite pieces. Like all three of these pieces I could have kept. 298 Swift. Like all three of these pieces I could have kept I uh, kept. I'm I'm supposed to be doing the bard over, right? And then out the bard. That would have been a perfect piece of the bard. Perfect piece for the board. Um, I'd rather sell it. <laughs> and I'm, I'm going to gear my characters when we get to a con. I'm going to slowly be started. That's it. That's it. All the alts stop getting love. Once I get them all to 1490, that's it. They're sitting at that perfect parking range forever. Forever. I'm not moving them up. I'm not moving them up. We're going to find. We're gonna be at that wean out stage of the content where we're only getting content every like couple of four or five months. And even if we do get rushed content, we're, they're only going to have so much content for us. Like, straight up. All the big pieces of content will start being, like, six months to a year out again. Um, or at least, or maybe not that long, as long as it was before, but it will start at least being anywhere from three to six months. So we'll have a ton of time to grind and farm. And yes, the thresholds are going to get larger, and yes, it's going to be more difficult. But the whole point is, is that I'm going to be focusing on six characters. Six characters only. Um, and then the ults will just be to make, like, the gems, basically. So I'm just going to start power, power jamming like i'm basically going to be getting all my level 10s and all my main sixes like i'm going to start finally primo supremoing them out um and the jewelry prices on ancient should come down and if we do get another tier of jewelry that's perfect because well, i'll have the top tier of the last tier and eventually i'll move into that you know what i'm saying so we'll see how it works out we'll see how it works out but eventually these guys are going to be getting some serious love soon we're almost there we're almost there 